Before beginning her journey as a painter, Mavis Nellameda was a master weaver in many of the styles practiced in Arakoon. And so when she was young, she was taught how to weave in um, some of the styles that were popularized by the Presbyterian mission in the community. And then later in life, she began using ghost nets and other materials to create different kinds of weaving as well. As a coastal community, Arakoon um, has a lot of access to ghost nets and other objects that do wash ashore, often from um, fishing trawlers or just being washed up from sea. And they do feature a lot in her, in her works. And so this work here, Dragging Net at Les Creek, also features a moment down the bottom here where we can see two women using one of these dragging nets to collect fish. Other objects that also wash ashore are featured in this work, such as the, you know, the red 44 gallon oil drums, which are then repurposed to like many of the objects washed ashore. And Mavis did also create other ghost net objects using these materials that washed ashore, such as magpie geese and baskets, which also are really, really playful because they also include um, objects like a children's thong or, um, or toys or butterflies. We can see that in Mavis Nellameda's paintings, her expertise as a master weaver really shines through in the way that she's able to create these really dense patterns and weave all of these different compositions and lines and moments within the painting together.